Hi guys, welcome back to my puzzle channel. Puzzle? Oh my god. I don't even know what it's called. Okay, sorry, let's go again. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. First I would like to say Happy New Year and I hope you had a lovely time during holidays. For the first video of this year, I decided I'm gonna treat you with the blooper reel from all the videos from 2022. Well, it's not all of them because I started collecting them from 15th video onwards because I didn't think of it sooner. So yeah, the majority of the videos are gonna be in the blooper. If you've been with me for a while, then this is probably gonna be really enjoyable for you. But if you're new to my channel, then this is a great way for you to get to know me a little bit more. Well, my ridiculousness anyway. <laughs> as usually, I divided this video into different sections as well. So I'm just gonna start with the first one, which is basically when you just can't get it right. It's been two weeks now and I have been thinking about the strategy, strategy, oh my god, I can't say it, St strategy, oh. It is normally enough, I mean, sometimes I run out of space, but that happens really, very rarely, very, but that rarely happens, okay. I don't think I've ever done something that was as detailed, as detailed as this one. <laughs> I can't say it. Okay, the next brand in this section is gonna be from the Safari wooden puzzle that I have and it's cross strategy cross strategy products. Da The next brand on this list is cross strategy products. I assume that many of you know by now that I'm Slovenian, which obviously means that English is my second language. So there definitely has to be a section of the floopers that says when English is just not your first language. It's time to move to the medium pile and the first puzzle on the list I don't have with me because I already exchanged it. Ah, exchanged it. <laughs> so today's topic is must have for puzzle lovers. Must haves. What must, must haves. So today's topic is, so today's topic is must have for puzzlers. Puzzle lovers. Oh my God, I can't say it. It's slightly different, like, you have to really close look clean. Close look clean. <laughs> Before we go into the puzzles, I just wanna do a quick, not time lapse, what is it called? Montage, montage? So with these foam boards, I can just place them wherever I need them to be in order for me to do the puzzle instantly. Oh my God, I, I just can't get this sentence straight. <laughs> so with this puzzle, so with these foam boards, I, it, it, and this is just gonna be evaluation of all the puzzle brands, of all of the puzzles, I, of the puzzle brands of the puzzles that I've done in 2022. So, the next section of the video is somehow related to the previous section as well. So to some extent it has to do with the fact that English is not my first language, but sometimes it just happens that, you know, my mind just goes completely blank. So if I remember correctly, it was W8 Smith City Breaks and the title of it was something bus route. I'm gonna <laughs> have to check that out. Yeah. There are two downsides of this particular puzzle board that I have. So the first one is, what's the first one? Uh-huh because I really like when they do this. Now moving on to the charity shop pile. So like I mentioned before, this one has one puzzle from where? I literally just used that word, how did I forget it? Flea market. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> so, okay. Oh my god, that took a while. <laughs> and finally, we get to a point where not everything is completely my fault. So I'm gonna call this section outside interruptions. I got beaten by a mosquito. Ah. 
It's annoying. Okay, this was complete. And and the second let them all come. Okay, so they're gonna stop being loud. So and the second puzzle. What was the title of this one? Sweet temptation, nice. I thought everything was quite clearly separated, but once I started to saw the pieces and putting the puzzle together, a lot of it was just blue. And my sister just got home now, so I'm gonna have to stop for a while. A 500 piece puzzle from Ravensburger, and the title of this one is... I don't have the title. Oh my god. He's got a bag over it. Sometimes I mess up so badly that I just start speaking to myself in Slovenian, so that definitely has to get its own section. And don't worry, I'm gonna put English subtitles underneath so you're gonna understand what I'm saying. At this point I thought it would be fun to teach you how to say puzzle in Slovenian. So it's probably gonna be a little bit complicated if you're not from like a Slavic country, but I'll still give it a go. So what we call puzzle is basically Sestaulianka. And this is also a great time for you to share with me how you say puzzle in your native language. So you can just write it in the comments down below. And let me finally show you the bloopers now. I really do like, tre I really like truffle puzzles. Oh, Abunji is down at 11. Okay. Seriously? So mm. it's Squirrels. Ow. Kerch. <laughs> ah, funny. I'm not sure it was the smartest choice. Like it picked more up. Ah, so close that. I had to record. Oopsie. Oh, I thought the battery was dead. But it's not. It just says record, it's a new camera. So, <laughs> these are all the brands that I've done their puzzles this year. I've got a few other brands in my. <gasps> I'm realizing now that the majority of the bloopers are actually connected to the fact that English is not my native language because sometimes when you're growing up with a language something is gonna be really simple for you but for someone else it can be an actual tongue twister you know and the next section are basically just gonna be those random bits when I just can't take the word out and I just start blowing raspberries to relax my mouth so there's gonna be a lot of <laughs> coming up next but anyway the first thing I'm gonna do <laughs> mm. Sorry my phone that <sighs> Sorry my phone that phone. <clears throat> okay, moving on to the exchange section. Okay, moving on to the exchange section. <laughs> I'm basically gonna do I'm basically <laughs> Oh I can't speak anymore. And obviously there have to be some parts that you just can't place them in their own category. So the next section are basically just gonna be like random bits. And here they are. Ah, yeah. Oh, decisions, decisions. I think it's good to have this variation of like because it's still completely different than just putting a random ribbon grip cup. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. 
Today I have a magic puzzle for you and it's basically a puzzle that you put together and then you've got these special glasses so you can see the picture with these glasses <laughs> and it makes it 3D and then we've got the Disney one which was Alice in Wonderland <coughs> and then we've got <coughs> And then we've got the Disney one, which was Alice in Wonderland. <clears throat> but, oh my God, we've got the finished puzzle. I'm not gonna even attempt to do a pickup challenge. The last clip I showed you was actually quite heartbreaking because the camera didn't pick up how much of the puzzle actually broke because the entire bottom corner literally went off the board and just crumbled. And in the beginning I actually thought I'm gonna be able to save it quite quickly and when I realized how much actually fell off I just had to stop recording and fix the puzzle. So that was quite bad. Like after spending that many hours on that puzzle the last thing I wanted was doing that corner again. But you know, it happens. I hope you enjoyed today's video and have a lovely day and I'll see you next time. Bye!